Hello everyone and welcome to another Jolly Tots at Home. Today we're going to have a story, sing a song and make a model of Moses crossing the Red Sea. So let's get ready to watch and listen. Let's wiggle our fingers. Well done. Today Rachel's going to say hello to everyone. Hello everybody. Shall we do the hello song? Hello all the boys. Hello all the girls. Hello everyone. It's nice to see you here. This week it's going to be Sixton's birthday. So let's sing happy birthday to Sixton. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday dear Sixton. Happy birthday to you. Now it's time for the story. So let's wiggle our fingers and get ready to listen. Well done. Today's story is called God Rescues His People and it's found in God's storybook, the Bible, in Exodus chapter 14 and 15. When the king let God's people go, God showed them the way through the desert. He was always in front of them in a pillar of cloud by day and a pillar of fire by night. Sometimes the people walked and sometimes they camped and rested. Then they came to the Red Sea. What were they going to do? The sea was too deep and wide to cross and they couldn't go back because the king had changed his mind and now his soldiers were chasing them. Moses said, don't be afraid, God will keep us safe. God told Moses to hold out his staff over the sea. The pillar of cloud moved behind God's people so the soldiers couldn't see. Then God blew with a strong wind all night long so the sea opened up to make a dry path for the people to cross. The people hurried along the dry path until they were across the other side of the sea. In the morning, the soldiers started chasing the people. They followed God's people into the Red Sea. Then God told Moses to hold his staff out over the sea again, and the sea covered the path and the Egyptian soldiers so that God's people never saw them again. God had rescued his people from the Egyptians, just as he said he would. They were so happy, they sang and danced and praised and thanked God. This week the song is called, How Did Moses Cross the Red Sea? And it goes like this. How did Moses cross the Red Sea? How did Moses cross the Red Sea? How did Moses cross the Red Sea? How did he get across? Did he swim? No, no. Did he sail? No, no. Did he fly? No, 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 no. Did he walk? No, no. Did he run? No, no. How did he get across? God blew with his wind. Puff, 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 puff. He blew just enough, nuff, 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 nuff. And through the sea, he made a path. That's how he got across. So let's sing it together. How did Moses cross the Red Sea? How did Moses cross the Red Sea? How did Moses cross the Red Sea? How did he get across? Did he swim? No, no. Did he sail? No, no. Did he fly? No, 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 no. Did he walk? No, no. Did he run? No, no. How did he get across? God blew with his wind. Puff, 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 puff. He blew just enough, nuff, 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 and through the sea he made a path. That's how he got across. Today we're making a model of Moses and the people crossing the Red Sea, like this. So we need a piece cut out of a cereal packet, like this an A4 sheet of blue paper, a ruler, pencil, glue and scissors, and some raisins. So 
So with a piece of the cereal packet, cut the A4 sheet of paper so that it's the same length. It doesn't matter if it's wider than the, than the card. So fold your A4 piece of paper in half lengthwise. And then cut it down the middle so you've got two pieces. Then fold about three centimetres in. And then take the pencil and the side which isn't folded, roll the paper around the pencil. And then cut from the folded edge, rolled edge, down to the folded edge. And cut about two and a half to three centimetre strips. And then fold, roll this round the paper. The pencil again. And cut down to where you folded it. So there we have the C standing up. So you do that on both of the halves of the paper that you've cut and then we're going to glue it onto the card. So glue down the edge and then line it up. And glue down the other edge. And line it up so that the fold is on this side. And that's the Red Sea parted with the path in the middle. Now we're going to glue the raisins on and these are the Moses and the people crossing. So we'll put some glue, spots of glue on. And then press down hard so that the raisin sticks on the glue. And then you can put as many people as you like crossing over the Red Sea. So until you've got all the people crossing over the dry land where God blew and the sea parted. And that's how God rescued his people from the Egyptians. We're going to sing goodbye now. Goodbye all the boys, goodbye all the girls, goodbye everyone, it's nice to see you here.